by the European Union with a budget of five and a half million euros, Professor Vandermeer from the University of Lausanne coordinates the Baxin project. The research in my group is uh, what we call environmental microbiology. So we are primarily concerned with how bacteria can degrade uh, toxic compounds, pollutants in the environment. A number of bacteria are indeed capable of feeding on toxic constituents, therefore deteriorating pollutants in a natural way. The objective of this research in microbiology is to get a better understanding of how these bacteria work with a view to use them on a large scale. The project Vaccine is actually a project that tries to understand how to apply bacteria that you find naturally, grow them up in much higher amounts so that they can actually speed up the degradation of specific pollutants in sites that are very heavily contaminated. When, for example, there is an oil slick floating on the sea that you can come in with dried bacteria that actually degrade the oil, you can spray it on it and they will start degrading and eat the oil before it causes any damage on the marine fauna. These bacteria also allow to clean up extensive contaminated grounds. When the bacteria is put in contact with a pollutant in a lab, it renders it harmless. However, the efficiency of the bacteria can be reduced if it is introduced to a contaminated environment or when competing with other organisms such as microbes. Therefore, the aim of Project Vaxin is to understand how these bacteria can carry on being active in varied ecosystems. Organizing a project and coordinating a project like Vaccine with 16 partners is, is quite a lot of work in terms of administration. On the other hand, I find that it's extremely rewarding as a project because with these amount of partners you see the benefits of having different points of view on such a complex topic. And finally, for the students who work in the project, it's extremely interesting because this permits them to build like a network that helps them in their future career. My best advice for young researchers who want to uh, engage themselves into such endeavors as European project is to first try and get to a network as a partner. You can see how a project works and then after that don't hesitate to launch yourself in projects because it's the big chance to realize your ideas in a different way than just working on your own.